today I need to give you a trick about something usually our colleagues say that this is not so important but nowadays it is put in the guidelines of uh, uh, of uh, truma and guidelines of uh, ER departments and this is very important how to diagnose pneumothorax by ultrasound to make it simple try to to have an idea with me quickly by ultrasound you can diagnose pneumothorax yes you can exclude pneumothorax yes how much time it take no more than half a minute or at least you can take one minute let us to see how to do this to diagnose uh, uh, pneumothorax or to exclude pneumothorax in quick when, while you are in the AR and this patient considered he is in trauma directly you should check here and here uh, as we said before in Liechtenstein, uh, which uh, invented this idea to use the artifact of ultrasound uh, to diagnose pneumothorax directly uh, think that L is collected anteriorly and here is collected anteriorly if there is pneumothorax here or here or maybe bilateral so that you should check here and here here where in the second intercostal space here like that and check for what I will explain to you in the image now check for what? check for this sign which is plural sliding sign this is red and this is red and this is a plural line check the plural line if it is a sliding that means the space in between plural parietal and the visceral is not filled by air it is sliding well so that there is no air at this region okay go directly to that region on the opposite side the same time you, you should check the plural sliding sign this is upper rib and this is lower rib this is this line is the plural line it is a sliding yes it is a sliding look it is going up and down okay going up and down that means sliding and the sliding now by sliding and the sliding that means 100 percent there is no pneumothorax in this patient especially in that region especially in that region okay sometimes if this localized and insisted uh, in pneumothorax it is uh, another issue but look we are talking about the traumatized patient coming in the ER how to quickly uh, uh, to exclude pneumothorax put it longitudinal here and longitudinal here and sometimes you can use transverse but it is not so accurate like longitudinal like that now this is sliding and this is sliding in conclusion oh. sliding plural line means 100% no pneumothorax while non-sliding plural line means either maybe pneumothorax or others like what like plural fibrosis sphagial or selective intubation apnea uh, by this way you can exclude pneumothorax by lung ultrasound in half a minute then how to diagnose pneumothorax with confidence search for another sign named lung point sign and this will be inshallah in the next video thank you <laughs>